A special council meeting will investigate the impact of multi-million pound cuts being proposed by Devon County Council. The local authority is currently consulting on scaling back or shutting multiple services for elderly, disabled and vulnerable adults. One of its proposals is a plan to scrap a £1.5 million homelessness prevention budget, a cut that charities say could put lives at risk. Our political reporter Ewan Murray went along to the YMCA in Exeter. You do become like just one big family. You do look out for each other mm. and, you know, always with open arms. Callum says he was forced to leave his family home when he was just 18. He spent time living on the streets where he had problems with substance abuse. Obviously, I, yeah, when I became homeless, I got really bad on alcohol and basically cannabis. Um, they were the only things that are numbing the thoughts of, you know, being homeless. You know, I, I was able to sleep better without thinking, oh, I'm going to be robbed in my sleep, which happened quite a lot. But four years ago, age 23, he found the YMCA in Exeter, which provided more than just a roof over his head. They helped me understand my value in myself, because um, I was quite low, you know, coming off the alcohol and all that. It was, it was hard. But now it's the charity itself that's in need, with the news that Devon County Council is considering scrapping a budget for homelessness, worth overall nearly one and a half million pounds for Devon. I would just say, just think hard about this, because you're not only just potentially, you know, um, ruining people's lives, you're, you're ruining their future. You know, you want young adults to think, OK, I, I can do this, you know, feel good in themselves, not to make them feel stressed. And if the charity does close or make substantial cuts, others who've used it say that lives will be at risk, including Jonathan, who now works here, age 25, after he entered when he was only 19. I mean, like, why would you want to take away money from young, young people and people that, like, this organisation are trying to help people? Because without this, a lot of people might, might not get the help and make their lives worse than they already are, or end up in prison, or end up taking their life, or, do you know what I mean? So the places like this are really, really important, because without these, these places in, in place, people aren't going to have the support. Well, Ewan joins us now. You were at the council meeting where these plans were debated, but before you tell us what happened, can you explain why the council is doing this? Well, the council's stuck between a rock and a hard place, really. It has a, a legal obligation to balance its books or else it goes bankrupt. But it's trying to do that with a £30 million savings target for adult services. That's massive. It means uh, shutting the North Devon link centres, scrapping the homelessness budget, as we've just heard, also shutting respite and day services as well. Now, the council is saying that no final decision has been taken. That will happen at the Cabinet meeting in July. But even the consultations are causing huge anxiety for both charities and also service users alike. What Devon County Council have heard loud and clear today is everyone saying, don't do this. People will suffer. It's not going to save any money. In fact, it's going to cost us so much more money across everyone that lives in Devon. By having the February uh, budget and having that signed off. So they already made up their mind before they sent the consultations out. So how infuriating is that when people are not listened to and they're kept silent? So what happened at the meeting? Well, the committee was supposed to debate the uh, cuts and make recommendations to Cabinet, but they were highly critical of the report that they got, saying it lacked real detail about the impact. So they've called for uh, yet another scrutiny meeting uh, before they'll finally make their recommendations and have their say. Ewan Murray, thank you very much. Let's get a round-up now of other 